Hi there, Girl Scout seniors. My name is Mrs. Lauren. I'm your virtual program coordinator here at the Virginia Skyline Council. And I'm really excited to help you work on um, completing step four of earning your behind the ballot badge. Um, so far, we've worked together on uh, lots of different research about voting and elections. And today we're gonna focus a little bit deeper on campaigns. So let's get started. Step four involves you uh, planning a campaign. So you're gonna get an up close look at what it's like to campaign for an elected office. Um, in order to complete step four, you're gonna create a campaign ad of your own. Your job first though, is to study campaign ads from possibly three recent elections. Um, and that doesn't have to be from this year, 2020. That can be from previous years, maybe 2016, 2017, or 2018. Um, so I would say somewhere within the past several years, you'll wanna do some research. Um, and you'll wanna make some observations. Are those campaigns negative? Um, do they have some positive, warm and fuzzy highlights? Um, or do they have a little bit of both? Um, and then after doing your own research on campaign ads, um, then it's your job to create your own print or video campaign ad and make up your own slogan. Um, so that right there on your screen, I have given you um, a pbs.org website um, article about creating your own presidential campaign ads. But what I particularly like about that website is that it gives you some videos um, on some campaign ads that were already created, specifically in the year 2016. Um, so it's just nice to go through and maybe watch some of the campaign ads in order to do a little bit of your own research. And then they also give you some documents and handouts on how to create your own campaign ad. Um, so I think that that PBS website is a great one to go to um, for you to get a little bit more research and highlights on creating your own campaign ad. So then when it comes time for the creation of your campaign ad, um, I have two websites listed there on the screen for you. Obviously my go-to favorite, the free print and infographic website, which is www.canva.com. Um, and as you can see, I have three already created um, kind of campaign ads that were on the website, just to give you a little bit of inspiration. Um, so these are three ads that I found on there myself um, that I thought were really cool. They, they are three different types of topics, um, but I really liked the way that they looked. So that just gives you a little uh, bit of an example of a campaign ad. Um, and then over here to the right are um, some top 24 free video editing software sites. Um, it gives you 24 different links of um, free software that you can download on your smart device um, or your uh, laptop, and it will allow you to edit your video for free. So you can use your webcam. Um, a lot of us are very familiar with the smartphone and videoing on there. Um, but if you wanna edit the video, um, you can definitely upload it to your laptop or tablet and use one of these free um, software sites. There's also thousands of free um, smartphone apps that you can download. Um, specifically, for example, Apple has the um, iPad Movie Maker. Um, that you can go in there and add in your own graphics, your own slides, and then it will compile the video for you. Um, so that is definitely another option. And just for fun, over on the left side of the screen here, I listed um, a bunch of different careers that you can research and explore um, if you're interested in pursuing campaigning um, as a career. Um, so they've got lots of different careers that you can explore if you're really, really enjoying um, our whole behind the ballot um, badge series here. Um, so fundraising, speech writing, becoming a lawyer or a lobbyist. There's just lots of different ideas over here if this is a career that you're interested in or pursuing. 
If you'd like to share what you've learned or if you have any questions about completing step number four of the badge, I encourage you to reach out to me, Mrs. Lori, at info at gsvsc.org. I would love to see your campaign ads printed or if you have a video and you want to send it in, um, I would love to take a look at them. Or if you have any questions or concerns about um, completing step four, do not hesitate to reach out to me. Um, as stated in our previous steps, um, now is your opportunity to join us here at the Virginia um, Skyline. Um, so if you are not already a Girl Scout and you want to join us, please definitely go to the website there uh, that's listed on your screen. And if you are currently a member and you haven't renewed um, your membership for this coming year, we really, really strongly encourage you to renew as we have lots of virtual and um, some small in-person um, events that are gonna be rolling out here soon. So we definitely encourage um, you to renew or join with us today. The next time we meet Girl Scout seniors, we'll be completing the final step five of the Behind the Ballot badge. So I look forward to seeing you again soon. Bye.